Hi, I'm Heather with Especially Paper, and I'm going to show you how to make a paper flower bud that's based on a fringe. This is a great flower to use to fill in space if you're making a flower wall. So to start, rub the petals to shape them on a sharp edge. So I usually use the edge of a table. I'm using the edge of a box here just to make it easier to show in this tutorial. After curving all the petals, fold them up on both petal sizes. Just fold them up at the base where the petal meets the center. Then glue the smaller set of petals inside the larger set. I like to use white craft glue. My favorite is quick dry tacky glue from Scotch. When you set those petals in, make sure to alternate the petals so they fill in that space between petals. To create the fringe, add some glue to the band on one side of the fringe piece. This is an 8.5 by 11 sheet of paper that's been cut. And then just glue those two edges together and make sure that you don't crease the fold on the fringe pieces. So start rolling that piece. Uh, just keep it tight at the bottom and let the fringe strips kind of fan out. And I like to roll it around a, a thick dowel rod, or here I'm using a Sharpie that's a really nice size, so that you have a little bit of space in the middle of this. Once you finish rolling it, make sure you glue that end down really well. And then kind of gently pull out the pieces of fringe to add some shape. So again, make sure that you don't crease them. Just kind of pull your finger in, pull those out so they kind of stick out and you separate those fringe pieces. Continue to do that all the way around. Just kind of shape the middle until you get it to a point where you feel like that looks good. And then glue that to the center of the two petal pieces. Use a fair amount of glue here and also add some glue to the inside to make sure that that roll doesn't slide out. Got to keep it really secure and just put it right down in the middle. You might need to hold it down a little bit until that quick dry glue sets. And then you'll have this little fringe flower. So super easy. Because it's quick, it's a really great way to add some filler to a flower wall. In this particular one, we used it to add pops of color to an otherwise white wall. Have fun. I hope you enjoy it.